Dean, a fantastic win for the club and for yourself. Uh, just assess how you saw it today. Great game, wasn't it? A really entertaining game. I'll tell you, the supporters were here watching, they would have absolutely loved it. It was a humdinger. Uh, we scored some great goals. We took the game to Wrexham. Um, I felt we were... When we were 2-1 down, I didn't think we deserved to be 2-1 down. We should have been 2-0 up. We had some individual errors. But I take responsibility for the second goal because I asked the players to play out from the back. I asked the players to be brave and get on the ball, and that's going to happen. But the character we showed when we were 2-1 down to come back to 2 all and then come out in the second half after Michael Phillips had to come off with a foot injury at half-time. Rejig got the fence. Skip went right for the centre-half, which is not natural to him. And the character we showed to go on home in the game is, uh, is brilliant. So I'm delighted with the victory, and that one's for all our uh, super Stallion supporters. <laughs> you talk about um, you know the character in this team and in the build-up you were talking about how we still needed to work hard to get the result and we saw them fundamentals today as well didn't we? Yeah we dug deep hard walk, uh, I thought selection, I thought Ross was outstanding leading the lion. You know, he's got a slight hamstring niggle, so we didn't want to risk him playing the 90 minutes. And Mo come on, did a good job for the team. So I thought we, you know, we got a lot of things right today. We scored from two set pieces, which is very pleasing that we walked on on Thursday night. So look, we always walk on our set pieces on Thursday night, but just the character to togetherness. Nothing else is going to give us success in this division. You know, all the top teams walk, are the hardest walking teams, and we have to remain that way. You know, I'm not saying we're going to be one of the top top teams in this division, but we will, we'll be one of the hardest walking teams. And I think we've shown that in all the games. This is the first win for you at this level as well. Just talk about your emotions and how you're feeling today. Oh, it's not about me, it's about the team, you know. It's nothing to do with me, I'm just a manager. You know, the chairman's there, the board, yourself, fingers, our supporters. We're all in it together. If we're not in it together, you'll never have success, you know. There's not one person that's going to bring this football club success. It's the players, they're out there, putting their bodies on the line, making blocks at the end. That's what it takes. The hard work, all the hard pre-season games we had, you know, it's come to fruition today. But we've got to really enjoy this evening, all of us collectively. Uh, there's no doubt probably a nice little glass of red wine, I think, tonight. And uh, start looking and focus on Chesterfield tomorrow. That's my job. You spoke about in the week about it being um, a sort of battle against two different styles of play, and both our fullbacks scored today. Do you think they, Mendy and Afete, really made a difference? Top players, aren't they? You know, two young lads, 22, 23 year old lads. Mendy's got unbelievable left foot. I always say to him, when you, when you, when you open up your left foot and you get an opp opportunity to hit it, you, you know, let it go. He's got a beautiful left foot. And Mizzy just knows where the goal is. He sh should play centre forward, I think. I might think of putting him up there. Um, great head off him, great delivery for Mendy as well. So, um, like I say, two top players, you know, and we're very lucky to have them. And of course, this is something great to build on, as you mentioned with Chesterfield there. Just how important is it to use this as a as a build for, for the next few games that we got? Yeah, we've played four games, we've got four points. So I think our performances deserve a little bit more, apart from Stockport, who I think are an outstanding team. I think all the other games, we should have got something out of the game. Dagenham, we should have definitely picked up a point. I thought we should have won at the Oval. I thought we had a better side over the 90 minutes. Um, and today, look, I'm slightly concerned about goals we conceded. It's a little bit frustrating. Um, so we've got to prove that. We definitely have to improve on the goals we're conceding because we will score goals. We're attack-minded.